up, YouTube, man? Y'all know who it is, man. It's your boy, Steezo. And like I promised y'all in the older video, I was going to give y'all an update on my, uh, my interior. And this is what I'm here to do. So, ain't even sunny out here today. As y'all can see, I don't even got no, no jacket on because it's cool. But let me put one of these pieces down so y'all can see it. It's close enough to me, man. What y'all think? I don't know if this camera doing any justice. I don't know if it's really changing it up, but hey, man, it's close enough for me. What is it looking like out there in that YouTube world? From the camera kind of makes it look like it's a little darker, but it's real close, y'all. And man, see, I wish this Tahoe was out the way so I could have more room. But of course I can't move it because one of my wheels is still at the shop because one of them is cracked. And if y'all want to know why, y'all can check out this video right here and it'll tell you. And my wheel been at Motoyo's for 10 days now and they still ain't done with my wheel. I swear stuff out here in Oklahoma is either overpriced or they take forever to do it. It's crazy. So I'm gonna put my back piece on where here, my plastic piece, so y'all can check it out to see how I compare to my other piece, but I'm not gonna put like my trim back on here, up here, or here, because I don't have no, no door seals on yet. Oh, what the hell is this janky? What? I swear, boy, see that? This how y'all be building old schools out here, be riding around flexing. With some janky stuff like this. But nah, I don't want to put it on. I don't got no door seals. No, I don't want this raw metal to be hitting up on that fresh paint. Right here once I put it on. So I'm going to just put these back pieces in here. Slam these in there. And I'm going to let y'all see. And the bottom dash will begin painted real soon too. I'm going to have my boy Steve Ellis come in here. And I don't know, man. Y'all let me know what y'all think. I was going to leave the top piece all black and paint all this down here blue but then i was thinking about just leaving this black leaving this little brush look down in here and paint everything else uh black i mean blue so i don't know man y'all let me what is this y'all let me know what y'all think and i found the motor i just gotta go pick it up and check it out so y'all stay tuned for that and if you're watching this video, make sure you hit that subscribe button right now so you can be updated on all of this footage. All right, so there it is. Bam. Ooh, wee. What y'all think? Hey, look at them lines right there. The back piece lined up real good with that front. Shout out to my boy Isaac, man, that did the interior. He gonna be finishing these seats up too. Here's this side. And this, of course, I'm gonna get that, that cloth or whatever they put back there to make it look better, get rid of this, so it can match with the rest of this stuff. And like I said, the only reason this is open, cause I ain't put my plastic piece in there yet. And I'll put all that in there once I get the door seals. Like I said, I ain't want the door to be closing on just metal against plastic. So I throw that in there. Clean all that up. Look way, way better. And I don't know if I showed y'all this. This came with the car. The little rear deck. The Ruchi. Getcha. Nope, I ain't about to say that. Man, I got kids watching my channel. What y'all think, man? It looks pretty good though, unlike everything else that came with this car. And there was the rear deck. Some cheapy, crappy work done, but y'all know me. I'm gonna clean it up. And man, that's it, man. 
And like I said, I'll be keeping y'all posted. So hit that subscribe button. So when I be posting that video of that motor.